chances are, you know, based on the condition, what I see, and you know, when it's really hot. I think the the, mat, the fan motor is already, um, you know, done. I think it's bad, but. All right, guys. This is what the inside of a condenser looks like. Compressor, condenser fan motor. So right now, we're in the camera, we're removing the actual uh, capacitor to so double check if the capacitor is what's preventing the fan from not turning on. Chances are, you know, based on the condition, what I see, and you know, when it's really hot. I think the the, mat, the fan motor is already, um, you know, done. I think it's bad, but you always want to check the capacitor. It's very possible I change the fan motor. And then after, as soon as I put it on, we still have issue with the capacitor. So always check yourself. The capacitor looks something like this. That's the capacitor, and that's the contactor. Very simple system, but we got to check the capacitor because if that's not, um, if that's bad, that will prevent the fan motor from not working.